I, I think that one of the uh, most interesting um, kind of details in this story is uh, how uh, the threat actor leverages this backdoor and other tools together to communicate between uh, virtual machines and the hypervisor. So uh, just to, to give you an example, uh, let's say that one of your, um, yeah, I don't know, important uh, projects in your company, like uh, some um, uh, resource planning uh, software or whatever runs in a virtual machine. So uh, let's say then the threat actors manage to infect that virtual machine and then they start uh, beaming out to the CNC. If you monitor that machine, you're likely uh, to, to catch the uh, exfiltration. So one of the techniques they, uh, this group is using, for instance, they tunnel from the virtual machine into the hypervisor directly and the hypervisor uh, tunnels into the CNC. So let's say from the virtual machine, there's no network communication uh, with the command and control server, which makes it uh, more stealthy, harder to detect, 